Hey guys and welcome back to Twitchy Plays XCOM Enemy Unknown where I believe we are getting perilously close to the end of this game. I don't know. Well, the way things have been going here, it's going to be another 10 episodes or so. Like I have just been turtling my way through this like you would not believe. But as you can see on this board here, we have... Uh, the same problems we had last time, so that's not really too much to worry about. Uh, over at the barracks, let's have a quick look here. We have a lot of people, but we also have people down here, and not many of them have actually been promoted at any point. I mean, can you believe it? We are this close to finishing the game, and literally all we have are rookies. Okay, we're going into the side labs. Um, am I going to put any of these guys in? No, I am not. I'm just going to... Oh, I don't know. Am I... I don't have any support people. Wow, I'm just looking at the people I have here. I don't think any of them are going to be any any more use than any others. So let's just throw those in like that and see what happens. But the first thing we need to do is jump ahead those two days and see if we get any side training. Well, get successful side training. Okay, let's have a look. What do you reckon, guys? Gifted! Woo! Round of applause. And he's like a captain and stuff, so th this is quite good. I can't remember exactly what type of guy he is. Look, there we go. He is a snipper. We have many of those. Look, we've got two of them down here. Oh no, only one of them down here. Okay, so, okay. This is good. We also have promotions to do here, so let's go in and see what he does. Uh, Psy abilities. We've got learn Mind Fry. So, do I have to use this to upgrade these? Is, is that how it works, or is it just like as I earn XP? Okay, so let's come in here. We get the headshot. Have a look at all these we've got to choose from here. Uh, snapshot or squad sight? Mmm. I wonder. I'm going to go with that, that one. There we go. Um, so we got a gunslinger, plus two with that, with pistols, or damn good ground, because there's a plus ten and plus ten against enemies on lower elevation. I'm going to go with that one, because I intend to give him the, uh, what's it called, the... Uh, jetpack, the Archangel armor. That's the one, the Archangel armor. Uh, disabling shot or battle scanner. Now, the battle scanner I've literally just found out the purpose of last episode, so we're going to go with that because that looks pretty good. And what have we got? Executioner or opportunist? Oh, I seem to be a very right heavy person on the sniper one here. I don't know if that is like a standard thing across all my things. I don't know. Let me know. If, if you people have been paying more attention than I have, then you'll know. <laughs> okay, These so research could completely changed the course of scientific progress. A new untouched field of study just waiting for able minds. Is that the, the psionics, right? But we can't actually do anything here. There's nothing to change to, there's nothing like that. Let's go over to this uh, engineering. I don't think there's anything we want to do here unless we can put some money into the foundry, but you know what? I, uh, no. No, because we don't have the money. Uh, the only thing that I might want to do is put, put another firestorm somewhere, but we're, we're not going to do that. We're just going to carry on. The satellite nexus is nearly finished, which is good. Um, it's just a shame that we don't actually have any satellites to put on it, I don't think. Let's, let's go over to the situation room. Hey, here we go. Um, launch the satellite. Yeah, we, we don't have any, as you can see. No, no, that's not, we don't need more uplinks. We need more satellites. Why did you just tell me more uplinks? It's lies. It's lies. Um, I don't know why I'm clicking in here. I don't know what we're doing. Let's get back to mission control then and wait for this fusion launch to be done. Should really try and purchase one of those for my firestorms, right? But here comes the counter report. Hopefully something's going to happen in between. No, nothing at all. Well, <laughs> let's see what their report says of us this time. Oh, we got an A grade. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, people have chilled out a little bit. This is good. Brazil and United States in particular ones I was worried about. Uh, this is the mission count. I wish he would be quicker. Is there a way to get rid of him? Can we click over here? No, I didn't really do anything. Uh, monthly reward. Yep, brilliant. Awesome. Carry on. I'm sure you will. What we really want to know now is... Ooh, we've got we've got an exclamation mark. Does this mean I've got stuff we can do? Fusion launch available for manufacture. Yeah, we knew we knew this. And this is just like archives because we've got nothing else we can do because I we've just been turning it so hard. Team I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. Yeah, we've been turtling so hard that we've literally done everything. So we've got money. Uh, okay, the first thing I want to do is it the situation room where we've got the officers school? No, it's in the barracks. Uh, so I happen to know that that would have helped me a lot earlier on. Maybe it's not too great getting it now, but there we go. And also going to get the wet work. There we go. That's that's the money I wanted to spend here. Right? <laughs> that may have been a, a, a tad too far looking at how much money we got. In the engineering, there was definitely something I wanted in here. If we scroll all the way down, the thing I wanted... Uh, was it all the way down? There we go. Blaster launcher. Boom. Yeah, we definitely want one of those. Submit that order. 
Uh, and then maybe, if we can, Foundry. Uh, where is... Oh, yeah, look, we can't do it. That's a shame. It's the Illyrium. Of course it's the Illyrium. It's always the dang Illyrium. Um, oh, well, there we go. That, that's, that's what we get to do there. Anything else that we can think of? I don't think there is really anything else I can think of. I mean, I, I could possibly get another firestorm in. That would be quite good. But as it stands, I think we're just going to build this gallop chamber. Ooh. Who knows what mysteries will await? Oh, look, it's all purple. <laughs> what a shocker. It looks a bit weird, though, doesn't it? Uh, almost like some sort of Dragon Ball that's uh, sat on a throne of some description. In fact, you know what this reminds me of? A plasma ball sat on the throne of Erebor, you know, under the lonely mountain. Crazy. Crazy. So, I wonder what's going to happen. I've gone uh, assigned new construction, but we don't want to do that, do we? Because there's nothing else we want to build here. Look, there's nothing. We've got the hyperwave re relay, we've got the gollop chamber. No idea how you're actually supposed to pronounce that. And nothing else we can actually make other than the power generator, because we are just so low on everything. Oh, I see what's going on. Do we want more power, or is that just a waste of our money at this point? If I end up needing to do something, then we will do that. But until that time, we won't. So, what happens if I click this? It looks scary. Should we just finish our side training first? Uh, go on. It's just clear that the alien device will not respond to attempts at physical interaction. However, if we can find a soldier with strong enough psionic abilities, we may be able to activate it. Strong enough psychic abilities, hey? So, looks like the thing we're going to have to do is make sure that our guys are there using their psionic abilities. Uh, in fact, talking of psionic abilities, we go up to our barracks and go to the Psylabs. We want to throw someone else into the into the tank, right? Should we throw our spare sniper into the tank? See what happens. What I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Okay, into the mission control, scanning on. We got some some stuff. One is gifted, one is not gifted. That's good. That's fine. We can carry on like that. I, I, I really don't mind. Uh, what else do we want to do? We want to throw another two people in here. We're probably going to throw um, just some rookies in. Uh, like, as long as we just keep keep turning the rookies over, we should be good, right? Is that how it works? I hope that's how it works because that's how I'm going to make it work. Uh, we got this thing here. Okay, the psi abilities. Yeah, mine for I. Um, all right, waiting. Just waiting, waiting. Finally, we get some satellites. How many have we got? Ah, UFO. Right, scramble the interceptors. Now, the first thing I'm going to do... Oh. Oh. This is not good. Where, where's our firestorms and stuff? Why does the whole of North America not have a single firestorm, but instead has three interceptors? Bangs out. Yeah, I mean, we're not really going to catch it, are we? I mean, look at the size of that, and look at the, how... Ooh, fire another one! Keep going! Um, one more. Four. Okay. Next one, go. Right? No. Oh, damn it. There's not what I wanted to do. Shite. Oh, well, well, we're stuck like this now. I really wanted to shoot that down. Um, I clicked the wrong thing, though, and carried on scanning when I really didn't want to scan. Oh well. Uh, so they want five plasma rifles. We've only got three, and to be honest, we use a lot of plasma rifles. So I think we're going to let that one go. Um, oh, I'm really quite gutted that we just let that, that let that fly away like that. I really didn't want to do that. But what I am going to do instead is, ah, oh, would you believe it? We cannot build one because of our shortage of Illyrium. You know where we would have got some Illyrium from? That UFO. Well, that's a little bit annoying. Okay. We're just going to carry on then, I suppose. See what turns up, see what doesn't turn up, right? Um, okay, we've got some psionic testing results. We're getting a lot of gifted people. This is good. This is good. Um, there we go. Brilliant. Confirm. Mind fry. A lot of mind fries going around. I mean, yeah, it could be worse, could be better. Let's just carry on scanning for this activities and see what's going to happen. More. No gifts. No one's got any gifts. How dare you turn up to a party without any gift? That's just unbelievable. Uh, do we want to... Uh, now that I've put a heavy in, I don't, I'm not sure that I really want to have done that. But, yeah, you know, we're, we're going to deal with it. Ten days, eh? Ten days. Um, okay, this, did that, like, increase the panic in the United States at all? No, it did not. Um, we do have the opportunity to launch some more satellites, and I think I would like to launch a satellite in Mexico. Oh no, we've done that one, Argentina. That's that's what I meant, honest. So that we could actually just get like the full set. 
that, it's kind of what we want, right? Um, <laughs> I, I don't know why, because like we can no longer get any of the, of the uh, interrogations and stuff like that. But we get more money at the end of the month, I suppose. It's kind of what we're doing. Um, yeah, yeah, let's do that. Awesome. Okay, and we've just got these ones over here, which I would like to do, but we've only got like two satellites out of the three, and you know, that would be favoritism if we started doing that. So uh, let's just carry on moving. Got, got up chamber? No, no one's ready to use it. Okay. We've got some satellites going up, we've got some site testing coming in. I would like some something to do. Him. Ah, you know what I should have done? Was move a firestorm from somewhere to here. Uh, which one's ready to go? They're all they're all pretty much ready to go, right? So let's start with the Phoenix Cannon. I don't know why we're going to start with the Phoenix Cannon, but that's what we're going to do. UFO number 10. Is this the 10th one I thought, or just like randomly selected number 10? I, I don't know. Uh, so let's see what happens here. Hopefully we get... Oh, look, it's tiny. We, we should be able to do something here, right? So why, why we're taking so long about it? There we go. Awesome. So maybe, maybe now we'll get some Illyrium. That, that, that would kind of be the good good bit there, right? Okay, so what have we got? Ethereal, Muton Elite, Cyber Discs, Drone. Only six of them, so this will be quick, hopefully. This is good because we've taken like ten minutes just to get to this point in the episode. Okay, so what have we got? Who have we got? Browns. Browns everywhere. Okay, this guy. Is, is this two snipers now? Oh, why not? Let's take two snipers. Um, we're going to take the loadout, of course. Ghost armor, Titan armor. I suppose we're going to give him ghost armor because we can't give him uh, another set of Archangel armor. Only a laser sniper rifle. We really do need to sort that out at some point because this has happened quite often. Now, do we want to give this guy the scope just to be like, ah, look at me and my super killing abilities. But then he does kind of already have super killing abilities. If we're given the chitin plate and he might actually survive. What, what have we given? Oh, this guy's got a scope as well. You know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do it. Actually, I'm. I'm gonna go for the scope. I, I think having a sniper being able to like snipe even better, kind of like just adds to it. All right. Okay. So this is rookie Turner. You know what? He is going to be at least uh, somewhere down here. Come on, med kits. This is what it's all about. It's using the med kits. Uh, Titan armor. Brilliant. And we're gonna give him a plasma rifle. What more do we want on our standard rookies? What more could we want? Why are you using a standard shotgun? That's a bit rubbish, isn't it? You should be using the alloy cannon. There we go. I mean, you are you are my low-level assault, right? Which means we're going to send you into the fray first. I mean, oh, do we want to put Kobayashi further in the fray? No, we don't. No, we don't. Right. Give us this uh, this loadout. Uh, again, Titan armor, plasma rifle, pistol's good. Oop. And then somewhere down here, I don't know, what should we take? Chitin plating for the rookie? Yeah, that, that looks good. Right, does everyone look kind of set? I suppose people do look kind of set. I don't really like this blue armour. Let's have a look. What, what's going on here? Skeleton suit gives us a defence of 10. What happens if we give them the carpets? Oh, nothing. Ooh, okay. Uh... So let's let's have a let's do the thing we don't normally do. Health bonus three, as opposed to the health bonus four. Well, that sounds better already. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, that, that looks good. Does it? Does it look good? No. If we, I mean, if we're going, hmm, Titan armor, fourteen health. We're we gonna go with that. I'm gonna go with the Titan. It's kind of like the highest level we've got, right? And after all that mucking around, which took another five minutes, I think it's about time we got out and did some uh, death, doom, and destruction. Whew. Wow, this has been a long setup, guys. It's been a long setup. Okay, going over to continental yeah, United States. Let's see what we get. get we are board. in... Oh, within the continental United oh States. would you believe it? We are in an urban... Uh, not an urban, like a went down rural scenario. Populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Okay, number two. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Okay, we're coming down. Beautiful sunset behind us. Beautiful sunset. It's a shame it's ruined by the ugly alien men menace coming for us. Okay, there are but six people here. So, uh... The real question is, do we just go for the alien craft? Or do we try and find any outside patrols first? I don't know, let's, let's get kicks on the go. Right, kicks. you are the man. Get up there, forward face him. Do we see anything? We don't see anything. Is this it over here? 
I don't know, that's a tree. I don't know, we'll, f we'll find ways, we'll find ways. Who are you? You are our other sniper. You are, in fact, the highest ranking sniper. That's, that's no good having you there, really. Uh, is this a full cover position? This is a full cover position. That's good. Brilliant. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, rookies. Do we just, like, run them all the way up? No, no, that, that's a, a very silly idea, and you know it. Uh, that would also be quite a silly idea, but possibly not as silly. I think what we're going to do is run this one up here. Maybe I should put that one over there, actually. And then this one over here. And then we're going to start our Overwatch cycle, because there's not really much else we can do at this point in the game. If anyone else knows of any other tactics that I could partake in at this point of the game, please do let me know, because obviously I am just, like, too bad at this game to even realise that I should be doing other things. Alien activities! I think they got round for a good old uh, sing-song. bit of arts and crafts. Uh, okay, what we got? Uh, it's, it's not the best place to go to, but I think it's going to make do as a kind of waypoint on our way to like this better bit of cover over here. Still nothing spotted. That's all right. We can deal with that. We can definitely deal with that. This guy's going to come up and take Kick's place. Awesome. Possibly not the best guy, but you know, there we go. Uh, cannot move up that way. Okay, so Kix is going to have to stay out on his own for a little bit as this guy comes up here. Um, we'll, we'll just kind of leave him sat there, I think. Uh, and Turner is going to come on and take on this full, full flank, uh, not full flank, full cover position. Okay, awesome. Going well. I think it's going well anyway. Uh, where do we get a sniper? Well, ideally, we'd like to put our sniper up high. So if we can move this guy on at some point, that'd be great. Um, maybe, actually, back here is a good spot. Yeah, okay, this looks good. We're going to hunker down here. Okay. Um, it's because we couldn't overwatch when we haven't used, when we've moved and not used our plasma pistol. No. You know what I mean. I'm sure you know what I mean. Oh, I hear something. What was that sound? What was that sound? Something going to come into view? No. No, nothing coming into view. Where's a good spot to go and stand? Do you think up here would be a good spot for a, for a sniper? You can then look down and see what's going on. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, let's first start by moving kicks. Here's our man. We're going to move him here, see if there's anything up ahead. What do we see there? Oh, what is this? This is where the, the the spaceship is. Okay, this is good. Well, at least we've got eyes now. We can see what's going on. A little bit worried about what's down this way. I don't know why. I just have this sudden, imp uh, this sudden worry that they're going to come for me over that way. Uh, into there. Brilliant. Okay, cool. Uh, you... Ah, oh, can't follow Kix's... Uh, uh, that's a bit rubbish. Okay, so... Um, well, if we can dash, we're going to dash all the way down here. Or as we have to dash, I suppose. It's more of a thing. Oh, birds are off. Uh, sniper comes down here, stands in this position. He's being watched by his other guy, so it should all be good, right? Um, put him on a pistol and... Play watch. Yeah. Alright, awesome. Uh, this guy can also overwatch. This guy needs to make a move. Which I'm kind of feeling is that. Might be too far. Might be too far. Hopefully we're not going to see anyone scary. Um, and then we need to move this guy. Uh, it looks like it's going to be a double dash. Dash this round, dash next round. Um, or we could start using some flight powers, but I don't, I don't think we want to do that quite yet. So let's move this guy here, and then at some point we'll move him onto this uh, ledge up here and see if that helps at all. All right, kicks. You are also overwatching, and now everyone should be ready to make their move. Okay, let's see what the alien activities for today are, sir. Uh, not, not much actually. Not much. Okay, this guy wants to full on get up here somewhere, like here. That looks like a good spot to put my sniper. Hopefully, I hope. I mean, it could be a terrible spot. No? Okay, so he's got eyes on kicks. Terrible for, uh, way to uh, approach. Yeah, absolutely terrible. What have we got over here? Nothing nothing worth running for. No, nothing worth running for. Okay, let's go up there. Maybe we'll put another guy on this side, and then we'll be ready to start approaching. Like, who is this? Who are you? You're, you're just a rookie. That's good, because you're going in one of the most vulnerable positions. <laughs> nothing spied, okay. That's fine. We, we can go with nothing spied. 
It's, it's very quiet, isn't it? Almost too quiet. Oh, it should have gone there, not there. Oh well, now we know. Uh, not that we're ever going to be able to take advantage of that particular piece of information. Uh, and we could actually dash this guy up here. That should be fine, right? I mean, we should be fine. We should be fine. Okay, go overwatch. I can see lots of ways of this all going wrong, but I don't think any of them are actually going to happen. So hopefully, for minimum of payoff, we should get a fair amount of Illyrium here. Uh, minimum of pay. Yeah, you know what I mean. Minimum of uh, price. No, it's still nothing watched. Still nothing seen. We're going to swap over to our pistol, and we're going to overwatch. Uh, kicks. Look at that. You conveniently have the movement rate to get up there. Nothing spotted yet? Nothing spotted yet. Okay, okay. I wonder which way we're going to have to be looking. Now, did we see that there was an ethereal in here? Was that something we had to be wary of? I can't remember off the top of my head. And that's a bit of a shame because that's where I should be remembering this stuff from. Uh, okay, let's go over this way, but I don't think we're going to be in a particularly good position if anything kicks off. But it's what we got to go for. Um, there's, a, there's a whole tree here to hide behind. Maybe come down this way and into this door. Maybe. What I'd really like to do is move kicks up, trigger them, fall back, and then let my snipers take them out. In fact, let's get this sniper over here. There we go. Let's use the pistol. Next round, we'll be moving on to sniper rifles. Hopefully. Hopefully. Right. Mr. Bennett. Where where are you going? What are you doing? I don't I don't actually know actually. Actually, actually, wow, double words. Let's move you back down here. I know we just ran him up to run running back down, but you know, this is this is war. This these sort of things happen. Plans need to change. You know? Okay, alien activity. Are we just gonna have any There's something out there. We're gonna run into anything? Is anyone gonna say anything? No, nothing. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is swap. Okay, awesome. Now, stay sat there. You also swap. Stay sat there. Where's kicks? Right, my friend. How far can you get? There. We're going to go have a look. And we're going to run back. Brilliant. Time to run away. Why haven't other people shot them yet? Okay. All right. Fine. If that's the way it's going to be. Uh, so, 45% hit chance. Seems pretty low. What about this guy? 25. All right. Um... Perhaps the falling back is the plan. Uh, not that you have any good cover. Let's in fact put you here because you get better cover. Maybe take out that ethereal. Maybe that's the one we need to go for for 25. Maybe not. There must be something better we can do. Must be something better. I really thought, no, oh, no. Oh, why did I do that? Why did I do that? More importantly, how do I know when this guy's going to fire stuff back at me or not? I really don't know how this works. 45%. 60% crit chance, though. Huh? What happened there? Why is everyone doing more damage than... Like, what? what's this guy doing? No, I'm going to take him out. This is the thing that needs to happen here. Obviously. Really confused about how to deal with the other guy, though. Um, like... What happens if I shoot now? How many times does he actually get to reflect stuff back? What's the deal with that, hey? Did that do any damage? I don't know. It didn't seem to do any damage. Uh, Mr. Bennett, you can run up here. And fire on this guy. Oh, no, an <laughs> overwatch. Alright, excuse me. Uh, my midsummer cold is uh, still with me. Is this gonna this going to take him out? All right, that was good. At least that did some actual damage here. Uh, we got... Oh, well, there's a cyber disc and some drones. Worried about the cyber disc. Always worried about a cyber disc. Uh, maybe this is someone Kobayashi can take out, though. And um, what's going on here? He's in my mind. That's fine. Oh, no, that is not fine. We were fine up until that particular point there. That, did that work? Did he do any damage? Did he not? Okay, so all my guys are actually going to be on him. No? Why can I not fight? Oh, because I'm on the wrong type. Uh, so that should hopefully help. 
If nothing, this will like reclaim my soldier, right? Yeah, that's what we want. Reclaim soldier. Okay, now I happen to know that that. Oh. Quiet. Do you hear something? Oh, I didn't. But now that you've told me, I do. Uh. So let's spin round. So with that cyber disc on its way from somewhere else, from behind us now, uh, I kind of want to start falling back a bit heavier. Um, but I want to be able to, excuse me, stay in cover. Which is not overly easy, actually. Not without putting people at risk. Um, so let's have a look around here. What else can we do? Uh, this would be a good spot for a heavy, but unfortunately that's, that's no good. Um, if we run and gun, that puts us well in the path of evil. So I think... I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll figure out with Kobayashi right now. Uh, this guy is the guy who's actually in serious trouble at some point. Just on the edge of his vision, look. Um, so let's try and find a better place to put him. I don't know. I'm not sure what what my plan can be from this point onwards, actually, to be honest. Um, oh, you're panicking. That's fine. I kind of just want to wait and see what they do, but I'm, I'm fairly sure that's a bad idea. I'm fairly sure that's a bad idea, but we're going to do it anyway. We're going to go through, we're going to overwatch everyone. Is that the only thing we can do? Okay, let, let's just see what happens. I think we're in a relatively good position. We're, we're hearing some stuff, but that should be okay. Mm, okay. So I'm worried about what could possibly be this way. What could that possibly be this way? I'm really worried about that. Okay, so let's take Kobayashi. How far can he get? He can't actually get all that far around. Is this half cut? This is partial cover. Um, what do we have in here? This is also partial cover. I'm looking for somewhere with severely good cover to start getting me closer. Um, I don't know why I want... Could be actually to be closer. Actually, he's the he's the one who really needs to keep his distance, as he is our best man. Um, let's start making our way down to see what this big noisy thing is, shall we? That that might be a plan. Uh, we're gonna start with this movement. Uh, it would have been better to come here, but you know we're here now. This is what needs to be done. Um, okay, this person would like to fall back to here. Uh, it's, it's only a half. It's all dashing up here, isn't it? It's only half cover when I really want to be moving between bits of full cover. Um, but we just kind of have to do for the moment. Just going to kind of have to do for the moment. Um, it'd be nice to throw a battle scanner back this way, actually. How far can I throw it? Is this the maximum? Let's see, how, let's see what we get. Battle scanner's up. Hopefully with this, we'll see whatever it was that was making that noise. No, no, no we're not going not to be able to actually get to look to it when it activates so looking back here no nothing absolutely nothing where do you reckon it's coming from all right if we get around the corner do you reckon we're going to be able to shoot uh, i was worried about the the actual cyber disc though it's all it's all good having places for it's all, it's all good being able to go in and get like an easy one shot kill on a, a drone but trying to get that cyber disc is going to be difficult difficult though I'd like to go and flush it somehow if at all possible um, in fact should we move this guy into Kobayashi's spot um, let's do it with a dash should hopefully mean to, uh, next round tomorrow next round we'll have a good shot ready um, this guy, I mean, he's not really doing anything other than just standing here. Um, it'd be nice to kind of get round here and take a few pot shots, but that's going to get dangerous real quick. <coughs> so let's just leave him here for now, okay? I mean, one of the things that I keep being told is to take my time more. So I'm going to start taking my time more, taking it much slower. Let's see what happens. Is he disappearing? Is he moving? Is he doing anything at all? No, he's not. Have we seen anything down here yet? No, we have not. Well, okay. You. You can run and gun your way down this way, but that leaves you in a very, very vulnerable position. So let's do it. Yeah. Uh, this one. Enemy spotted. Yes, I know enemy spotted. You know, you'd spotted that for quite some time. 
Uh, I seem to be double flanked. That's not particularly good. Uh, do I go for this one or this one? Uh, this one's an instant kill, so it means less hits of damage. This one, yeah, no, let's let's do this. This is going to mean death, possibly for this this guy next. Uh, though we can now spot this guy. This is kind of one of the things I really did want to happen earlier. Five points of damage. Are you, are you kidding me? That's, um, that's weak. Can we come down here and take a shot? Is this a thing? No? Okay, we're going to have to overwatch. Should have triggered them. Should have triggered them earlier. Uh, I'm still super worried about the guy that's trying to sneak up behind here. Um, right, could be actually. You can actually take a pot shot, but I don't think we want to take it from here. Um, no, that's a dash. I mean, from here would be a. a you know what? Let's do this. Going in for the kill. We're going all the way down here. And then gonna fire at him. We'll see what happens. Like, lo lots of lots of pluses on the hit. Ah, not enough to actually kill him, though. That's a shame. That is actually a real shame. Uh, perhaps if we take this guy to here. Can we see? We can see, but can we hit on the fire? Like 55% hit chance, I don't know. Oh, wow, okay, that could have gone a lot worse. Oh, why have you panicked? You got no one to shoot at. Are you done? Are you actually done? Okay, so, and the, the last guy, which I believe to be this guy up here, can just overwatch. <coughs> so now, our task is one of um, surveillance. We need to go and find the big bad guy. Are you still panicked? You know what? Out of all the things that could be going on, I think a panicking rookie is not the worst. Um, okay, so let's uh, fall into this hole here. If we can just spin our camera around. Over there. This is good. Hopefully we're not going to trigger whilst we're just trying to run back and join this lot. That, that would be pretty rubbish. That would actually be really rubbish. Um, can we... Come in here. All these dashes, not too great to be honest, but at this point in the game, it is kind of one of the things that needs to be done. Um, okay, Kobayashi, can you you can ooh, walk to here? Let's do that. And Overwatch. Uh, you're going to Overwatch, though we could probably put you in a better position. Uh, do we have one left? Yep, I know we can hear it, but we need to go trigger it. So let's go find out what it is. Okay, so no more dashing moves. Ooh, literally just on a walk. That's all we can do. I mean, we're just going to have to see what sort of situation uh, awaits us when we're down there. This guy can come around this way. Oh, look. Brilliant amount of cover right there. These just rookies going up first? They are. That's fine. Uh, in fact, to be honest, that's kind of preferable because, you know, they're the ones that are going to... Uh, get the mo maximum output of taking kills. So, do we have, who do we have left? There should be one more somewhere. Did I just skip past them by accident? This one all the way down here. Like, you can full on run your little socks off, I think. All the way up here? Yeah, that's a good plan. Oh, we should have gone through the through the UFO. We would have kept more cover. Kept a lot more cover, to be honest. Yeah, we're just going to go through and overwatch everyone. I think I'm feeling quite good actually about how this goes. I mean, I know there was only a few targets, and we'd normally do quite well off of only a few targets. So, oh, here we go. Muton elites. Hopefully, the fact that I have all these uh, guys on Overwatch means that we're going to get some decent first hits. No, 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 no decent first hot hits. So, do you reckon these guys were just patrolling around? I mean, they they seem to have just run in for no apparent reason. They're diving for cover. That's easy. That's good enough. Oh, look. We can take a headshot. Uh, 68. 8. Oh, we're going to go with the 88, blatantly. The quicker we can kill, the better. Wow. Oh. Or. <laughs> um, okay. We can't run and gun all the way. Oh, look. This guy's in trouble. What should we do about this? Run over to this side? Yeah, let's run over to this side. Oh, awesome. And we've got this guy on an uncovered firing. Any good? Yeah, that's good. Alright. Oh, 
that, however, is not so good. Um, maybe we should have fallen back a bit more. All right, let's put Kobayashi, what, here? Yeah, let's do that. We're going to put him there. Oh, we could run and gun. We could run and gun, but we're not. <laughs> Just because we can doesn't mean we will. Um, oh, and this guy doesn't have much better to do. Uh, ah, this is no good. Oh, this is no good at all. Um, is there anywhere in here we can take cover? Like, just kind of here? This would be great, but it's not... It's a dash. I mean, if we're going to dash, we might as well come down to somewhere that's a little bit more... more strategic. I don't know where it's a more strategic place, though. Let's try that one. Let's try that one, see what happens. I can't believe I haven't done any reloading this, this game. Or this, this round, anyway. Uh, can we get cover here? Is this, is this good enough cover? That's not... Mm. I'm going to go with that one. I'm going to go with that one. Well, I mean, one we've moved in, but we can't really do anything with him anyway. Uh, Mr. Turner, you are actually going to be running around for the flank. This is the plan. Whether we can actually get there before anyone does anything, I don't know. But, you know, so I'm going to have to deal with things. Right, let's see what they do. They run forwards. Uh, they take some bad shots, I'm guessing. What? The? Bad shots, I said. Bad shots. And this guy's going to then finish him off, right? No? Oh, Overwatch. Oh, that's that's not great. Oh, God, this guy needs to reload. Why? Why do you need to reload? That's rubbish. Okay, um... Now, this guy is on a run and gun, but... Uh, sorry, this guy's on Overwatch, but we could run and gun our way up there. And I think Kobayashi has lightning reflexes. Should, should we do it? Should we do it? Okay. Boom! Right, and all the way up here, and then we'll see who we can shoot at. <coughs> lightning reflexes. This was my plan to save myself with my lightning reflexes, or at least save Kobayashi with that. Uh, and then when we're up there, hopefully just fire over the top of this bit of half cover we're behind. Uh, that one, yeah, 61% hit chance. But we are right there, right? Oh. Now I just feel like I've not even gone and exposed him for no apparent, like, good reason. Uh, where can we go that's also really well covered? Uh, not, not many places, actually, to be fair. Uh, shall we just fall in, like, here? Or here? Maybe here? If this is a better place, this would be great. Okay, who can we shoot at? 1%. 1%. Oh my god, Rot. Um, okay. <laughs> Whatever. Um... Uh, now, if we could take that guy out, no, maybe that guy. They're both terrible hits. What is this? Could we do this? 100% hit chance. Uh, launch a uh, damaging martial attack against a uh, mental attack, sorry. Reducing their will, aim, and mobility. I mean, that blatantly wants to be that guy, right? Let's try that. Let's see what happens. Probably not the best thing to be doing with my sniper, actually. Oh, oh well, we do some damage. That's fine. That's good. As long as we do damage, that's uh, that's all good for me. Okay, let's spin around, see what we're doing from this side. I'd love to come in over here, but there's not really anywhere to shoot from. Um, dashing. Do we, do we have any... Let's expose him. He's not taking any hits, has he? No. So we can then fire at him. 25. We'll take the 33. Terrible. Negative well, damage. what else can we do, eh? You need to reload. Okay. Let's do this. Uh, I feel I feel some damage is coming my way. That's fine. Ish. <laughs> and this guy is going to do the same? Yeah. Uh, that, that is not so fine. Though, it's just my rookie, right? Which was kind of, you know, who cares about the loss of a rookie? Right, this guy can now... Oh, can't shoot either of them? Why not? Why can he not shoot him? In that case, we're just going to have to kind of uh, go like this, I suppose. Oh, this look is, is it good? It's good. All right. This <laughs> could have been better. Um, if only we had given Kobayashi a uh, arc thrower, we could have brought one one of these in. That would have been good. That would have been great, in fact. But instead, we're going to shoot him in the side of the face from about two foot away. We only lost one, which is good. Um, to be fair, it is actually good compared to what normally happens. And I suppose I could have got away with not not taking that death. But whatever. I'm feeling good. I'm jubilant. I'm, yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's going on here. We're going to have some stuff. 
We've got some promotions, and we've got this guy being a heavy. We've got some uh, fire rocket. Brilliant. Well, it can fire a rocket. <laughs> uh, and this. Okay, what have we got? We've got tactical sense. Confers a 5% um, defense or 10% critical chance. We're going to go with aggression. No, no. Wait. Going to go with aggression. Confirm. I, I always like to kill them quicker rather than keep my guys alive, as you may have noticed. Okay, right. Let's uh, have a look around here. We got some Illyrium, finally, and UFO flight computers, power sources, stuff like that. This is all good. All right. Uh, now, what I wanted some Illyrium for, I believe, was to build some items, and in particular, to build one of these. One of our pla like North North America, I think, was the one that we really wanted to sort out. Oh, look, we could do two of them. Do it. <laughs> Yay! All right, cool. <laughs> Would be nice to get some fusion lances, but you know, whatever. Uh, okay, and with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. And I will see you next time when we're going to hopefully get some more Illyrium. Yeah.